Hi everybody, thanks for tuning in. We're looking at the Betty Page Halloween special for 2019, and this is coming out tomorrow. Tomorrow being Wednesday, October 2nd, which is uh, every Wednesday is new comic book day here. And uh, I just got my advanced comp copies, so I want to share these, um, share a look at these with you. Uh, the, here's the, the cover is not by me, uh, but the special has two stories in it. Uh, one is written by David Avalone with the art by Roy Allen Martinez. And then the second story in here is drawn by me and it is written by Erica Schultz, the great Erica Schultz who uh, this year she started to uh, teach at the Hubert School. Um, and we're getting a lot of glare off the light, so I apologize for that. Uh, and I don't want to give away the story, but there, just wanted to show you a few pages of the final printed matter, material. And then I wanted to show you some of the pages, some of the original pages. So these are the pages as I draw them. And I believe I gave you a glimpse of some of these pages while they were in progress in one of my earlier videos. So um, for those of you not familiar with original comic book work, uh, and I do work traditionally still, I do everything on paper. This is, I like three ply. I know I'm a prima donna. I, I like to splurge on three ply paper uh, and smooth, nice three ply smooth paper. Um, it's just easier to ink on, really. Uh, but the pages are 11 inches by 17 inches. So they're quite large, larger compared to the, the printed end result, as we can see here. So everything is penciled on these pages, directly on the pages. And then I, I do my own inking, so I ink them myself. Again, I don't want to give too much away in these pages. Hopefully you'll pick up, hopefully you'll be inspired to pick up the uh, special tomorrow. Um, I just want to show a few things. Maybe we'll get in close on this close-up. And get to compare that. There's the final colored, lettered end result. And the lettering was done by Erica Schultz herself. And the colors are Valentina Pinto. And I'm sorry, I only know that because I'm reading it from the credits right now. There's my War of the Worlds saucer. And there is my War of the Worlds. Now, I don't want to give away too much here. So, pick it up tomorrow, hopefully. Uh, please let me know in the comments below what you thought of it. Um, I had a lot of fun. I had a lot of fun working with Erica. She, she writes a really uh, good artist script. That is to say, um, it's a script that's fun to draw. There's plenty of action. Lots of eye candy, like aliens and flying saucers. Um, I also got to draw something that I enjoy. Maybe a lot of people might not. But I also got to draw some vintage cars. I love vintage cars. So I got to draw a few of those in this story. And guns. And guns shooting at flying saucers. The best of everything. There's a close-up on Betty herself. So I will have... Yeah, aside from just making you aware of this issue tomorrow, uh, this week is also New York Comic Con week. And for me, New York Comic Con uh, also it means the end of the, of the convention season. It's my last convention appearance of 2019. I do have a couple of uh, comic shop signings coming up in October, and I'll, I'll be talking more about that later. Um, but as far as, as conventions go, 
this is going to be my last one, and, and of course, it's one of the biggest ones. So, and that uh, the convention starts this Thursday. Uh, I'll be in Artist Alley in, um, uh, in uh, my table number is D17. You'll see me right, be, right next to my uh, Die Kitty Die partner, Dan Parent. And on the other side of me is the new president and owner of the Cubert School, Anthony Marquez. So um, come on by. Make sure you come by and see us. If you want to see these pages in person, they'll be, they'll be there on display and uh, available also for purchase if, if you're so inclined. Uh, also, early on in the convention, too, um, I'm just plugging everything here. Uh, Thursday at 11 a.m., uh, and you'll have to look up the room number because I don't remember it off the top of my head, uh, but there is a Cubert School panel, and it's a, it's a really big panel. Uh, Andy Cubert will be there. Uh, Anthony, of course, will be there. Um, I will be there. Uh, Erica Schultz, my, my colleague, Miss Betty Page Special, she'll be there. Our events coordinator, Lloyd Briggery, the great Lee Weeks, uh, one of our most prestigious graduates, Stan Mataloni, um, and I hope I'm not forgetting anybody. I'm doing this totally from memory. Uh, but we'll be there. It's early in the show, 11 a.m. on Thursday, um, so please uh, check it out. Uh, and if you follow me on Facebook uh, or Instagram, uh, I've posted about this, uh, th this panel. So all the details are there. So if, if you want to look up my pages on either of those uh, sites and, and you can find out more and you'll find out the exact uh, room that it's in. Uh, a couple other things to show you. Uh, speaking of the convention, I've got a few pre-convention commissions. Uh, this one is a blank sketch cover for Civil War. And that is the Billy Tucci character, She. And this is, uh, this is my first crack at she, so I, I hope you will be kind. Um, she was fun to draw, though. She was uh, very much uh, kind of a, a realistic Veronica. Uh, and she is drawn in pencil, colored with uh, inked, and colored with uh, uh, Copic markers. And this is another pre-con commission and this one I get asked for uh, I've been asked for to do this a few times and that is our own uh, die kitty die as a uh, Batgirl and uh, she's fun she's fun to draw uh, the purple in the costume can be a little bit of a bear because um, you really gotta do a lot of mixing and blending and there's even some colored pencil in this one um, but I always enjoy visiting the that Batman 66 universe. And here's one that isn't done yet. I gotta, I'm going to go in with a, a background, and it is obviously Sesame Street's Elmo um, as the Punisher. And I'm going to put some Easter eggs in that background, as, as I'm prone to do. Uh, there's another one I have here, and this is Kitty as a star sapphire on a Green Lantern sketch cover. Um, and this was a lot of fun. Been having fun lately doing uh, space uh, scapes. Um, and maybe I'll, I'll talk about that in one of these videos coming up. So I'm gonna be scanning all of these. A couple of these I've posted already on my Facebook page, uh, but I'll be scanning these and posting them up, uh, all of these uh, up um, soon. So um, that's about it. That's uh, wanted to talk about the show, the upcoming uh, New York Comic Con, and to um, remind you that uh, the Betty Page uh, Halloween special goes on sale tomorrow. So uh, make sure you know, make sure you you pick it up. Hopefully, your store has ordered plenty of copies. Um, you may want to call them and ask them to reserve copies. Um, and uh, let me know what you think. Uh, thanks a lot for tuning in and uh, listening to me ramble a little bit. And uh, you know, if you if you enjoyed this this ramble, uh, click like, 
Uh, if you haven't subscribed, I hope you'll think about doing so. And, um, you know, don't be afraid to share. Don't be shy about sharing. That's how we get the word out. All right. Thanks a lot, everybody. And I will see you at the in the next video. Bye-bye.